So if you have made a purchase from the App Store and you are looking to get a refund, well this video is for you. So the method I'm about to demonstrate will be on a computer, however if you are using an iPhone or an iPad, the same method will still apply. So the first thing you need to do is go to Apple's support website which is getsupport.apple.com and there will be a link in the description of the video to this website. From here you want to click on billing and subscriptions and on the next page you might need to scroll down a little and you want to click on subscriptions and purchases. This is going to bring up a submenu box and you want to click on request a refund. When the next page loads up you want to click on request a refund just on the left and here it's going to list all of your purchases you have made on the app store. What you need to do now is find the purchase that you want to refund. So you can either scroll through this long list of purchases or you can go back to the top and click on the following categories. You can also browse by invoices as well. So let's pretend I've just purchased this Quibi app and I want to get a refund. I'm going to select report a problem just to the right of it. And then you want to click on this drop down box next to choose a problem. And you want to select I would like to request a refund or select any of the following that meets your criteria. In the text box below, you want to describe more about your issue in detail so Apple can fully understand why you'd like to request a refund. And once you've done this, you want to click on submit. Now, if you do qualify for a refund, you may not see the money go back into your account for another three to five working days. This is all down to payment processing, so don't worry if you don't see it straight away. If you scroll all the way to the bottom of this page and click on this blue link here, this will take you to the subscriptions and purchases page where you can read more information about it and have some of your questions answered. And that is all you need to do to manage and request a refund for your app store purchases. So if this video was helpful, please leave a like and pass on to someone who may find helpful as well. If you have any questions or comments, just leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching and have a good day.